tonight, Billing City leaders are keeping their fingers crossed, hoping lawmakers in Helena can push through this legislative session to help with our rising crime. But the task is going to be a little tricky as the session comes to a halfway point where deadlines for bills become critical in order to pass. Our David J has a look at what City Council hopes is accomplished. City Council received an update on what's happening in the Montana legislature. And a lot of the bills that it supports center around public safety. Turns out that a lot of cities around the state are looking at billings to see how well some of these laws might work here. Do you know the status of bill on the uh, sober living homes? The sober living bill is among the city's priorities. We as a city have established since I've been on council three years now, the public safety is our priority. And it was that way before I even came on council. Senate Bill 94 is one of the bills the city council supports. It would require sober living houses to maintain certain standards and become certified through a nonprofit organization. Senator Barry Usher says the bill would allow felons to live together. People coming, mostly coming out of Department of Corrections, or they may be on parole or probation, living in the same house, trying to be peer support for each other, um, hence the name Sober Living. The city is also looking at other bills that Usher has sponsored. I'm a retailer in my real job, and you know people know that they could steal $1,499 and they could, you know, police would not respond, they would not show up, they would not take a report uh, because it was non-arrestable, non-jailable, and the fine was only $500. Senate Bill 95 would change that by modifying a 2017 bill. Welcome up, Senator Chris Fredell. Three former Billings City Council members now serving in the legislature also gave updates. Representative Larry Brewster, Representative Mike Yakowich and Senator Chris Friedel. Legislators say if a law works for Billings, it will work for many other cities around the state. Billings is definitely the place to look to find out what we need to do for the rest of the state. You need to have a sense of community, community compassion, but also of accountability and responsibility to each other. In Billings, David J, MTN News.